Sauce fighting for seventh here. First set of top eight. Welcome to top eight of Supercharged. All right, we made it to the money, but we want even more. It's so the money, we gotta find even more of that money. Yes, PS2 is our starting stage. I think this is a good stage for both players. So you get to kill off the top at, with Mario. You have those platforms to juggle, and you also can do that with Ivysaur in Beast's case. But this is a big thing where Beast like started to level up was his Squirtle. Mm -hmm. His Squirtle play allows him to okay, get the catch him right there. But the Squirtle play allows him to like box with Mario and like do so certain Ooh. things. And getting the spike right there, getting the early stock. Oh, hello. That was nutty. That was a little crazy. I ain't talking about the professor, man. Oh, oh my. Both these players running insane reach so far. And Beast now up a very decent amount, up a full stock, looking to get this lead up more. Sauce really struggling here because, like, this Ivysaur, he's opting for more of the Ivysaur in this fight because, like, those disjoints are going to be so, so good for you against Mario. So yeah. the one thing Mario struggles with is big hitboxes. Yeah, and we saw Jackal able to DI that perfectly, but we saw Beast just die holding inwards onto that DI and just dying a super, kind of early percent for Zard. Oh yeah, it's the thing, like fighting against Mario, he has a really good ladder comps with those early stocks, but of course, Beast now playing more close to the ground. As Squirtle, like you said, has been leveling up, Lady Thing, very well so far. Looking to get back in here, looking for another crazy read. Oh, yeah, who's threw feeling him back himself in, this game one? Threw him back on the stage, nah. I'm going get back to give, here. I'm gonna give you the hands. I'm not done with you yet. You know what that reminds me of? Ever watched like Teen Titans? Yeah. There's a like an episode where Robin's fighting Slade by himself. And Slade like saves him. And he's like, "Why did you?" Save oh yeah. Me? It's like, "Why did you save me?" He's like, "I'm not done with you." <laughs> <laughs> just gives him more the hands even more. Yeah, Beast is feeling himself right now. Very, it's insane on that nair, finding the parry into an up smash. Beast with a two stock in that game one, and that's the thing too. We were just talking about advantage day versus disadvantage day. Like, who who cares about your disadvantage day? If you are constantly in the driver's seat. Yeah. You're just going. If you're Beast took that game and he just went. Says, I don't like the sauces you offer. All right, that was my two. I'm more of a I'm more of a blue cheese guy. I'm not a ranch guy. I'm actually not a sauce guy. I'm like plain. I'm a plain Jane. Plain Jane like what? Like wings? Yeah. No, like tenders. Like tenders? Yeah, just dry. Really? Yeah. Come on, man. I'm like, I'm a I'm a boring Nothing person. Though? I'm a boring person. I like person. a barbecue and something like a nah, ketchup. I'm really boring, man. Yeah. So you like you could have at least put the, you could put the bias aside for this set though. Yeah. For sauce. This, oh. this, this is your favorite kind of sauce. What you said. Oh. <laughs> 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 All this, right. This is the sauciest I get. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right, I'll give you that. I think it would have been funnier if my name was Sauce. My tag was also Sauce. Like, and then you just go like get lunch with me. He's like, yeah, he doesn't use anything. This guy's a fraud. <laughs> oh, Wait, what was that angle? Oh, okay, yeah. he's able to make it back. Good job, that fact that he can switch and just get another jump. Oh my god! But now Sauce converting off of that and getting back into here. That Nair out of shield. Now looking to match the energy of Beast earlier on. And instead of like, he started the last game really passively, but oh my god, Beast with these callouts. Yeah, so I love the fact that he went out there with the Nair, said, I know you're gonna go low, I'm gonna do reverse Nair, you're gonna die, but you're gonna miss this tech, and you're gonna die. You gotta hit those techs, man. People yeah. keep missing techs against Mario, you gotta hit those techs. No tech zone. It's a Texylvania, man, what's going on here? Oh. Yeah, Sauce so still able to make it back. Looking to find a grab or something with this combo started. Yeah. But Squirtle, with that, again, that very small extra range is so much in this matchup. Yeah. And the fact that he's able to now get conversions with Squirtle off down tilt, up tilt right there, and just w use his momentum to get back and forth. And getting the Razor Leaf into the up air, closing out the stock, only 9%. Even with Squirtle being one of the lighter characters in the game, 9%? You're not going to kill him that easily. The thing you got to keep in mind, too, because like you could get a little too aggressive here. Sauce could find the stock very early. But now Beast doing everything in his power to find all the damage while he still can. He's getting every single nickel and dime out of the Squirtle right now. Yeah. Okay, was it able to get the trade right there? Ooh! Okay, yeah. that would have been crazy. Ooh. Fireball coming on again. Beast opting for a forward air, but still, this Ivysaur pushing the lead, and Sauce is just looking... 
struggling to find any openings right now. Okay. Good job using the other jump to like figure out which way if you're still turned or not. Oh, preemptive up smash right there. Down two. Yeah, it wasn't. Okay, yeah. Ooh. But yeah, wasn't like really like has was really hesitant on that down two, on that conversion, and that kind of cost him that game. Yeah, it's the thing too. Like Salsa playing really reserved this set. Like he's like obviously he's coming with those crazy, insane, aggressive plays, and Salsa kind of like taking more of a step back, like waiting for those opportunities to find those combos. And Beast is just not giving it to him. Like he's constantly just going, going, going. He's scrapping. Salsa needs to scrap back, fight back, man. <laughs> he's getting beat up. Just like kind of like was it the meme when you get a jump? Fight back, fight back, fight back. <laughs> let him, let him, let him, let him get up, let him get up. <laughs> Okay, but not getting the chance. And that's what you have to do against, like, characters against, like, Mario and stuff. You don't give them the chance to, like, gain momentum. And even, like, players like Sauce. We saw, like, Jackal gave him the chance, and he was able to steal the stock right there. Okay, going to survive the ladder right there. But against players like that, you try to smother them and say, yeah, you cannot play the game. Mm -hmm. It stopped them from any means necessary, but now Sauce... Looking to face match that energy down there to catch that switch with the back air. Looking to find another ladder combo. Keeping the pressure away from this Charizard. And just keeping your feet down on the ground saying, okay, I need to stop letting this PG get away with so much. And just find the hits where I know I can. Like that yeah. back air right there. Yeah. I'm actually surprised. This is not the Joel I know who would do the falling up into up smash and say parry all this. I miss the old Joel. This is... Come on, man. This is this is this is new age. We're learning how to hold backwards, bro. We're being patient, and of course, that's what happens. This, you get a this guy played Street Fighter one too many times, and now he's holding back. Wow. <laughs> this guy definitely feels like Ken. There's no way, right? <laughs> no doubt. Do you know who he plays? Uh, I don't think he plays Street Fighter. No. I, I I heard him talking about it, so maybe. Oh, maybe. maybe he does play Ken. Maybe. maybe. He, he, I, he's I would... definitely looking for a character that holds forward. He, he's not playing Guile. <laughs> he is that, not. <laughs> I imagine he plays like Sim. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that should jump up play Dol Sim. It's like, oh, this is not you. Bro, the fire, bro. He's so sick. Oh, yeah. ooh, big yoga. down there. Yoga. <laughs> 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 I love yoga. <laughs> <laughs> okay, not able to get convert off that fair. <sighs> but Sauce now gaining momentum. This is what we were talking about before. Against players like this, you need to smother them. Sauce now getting into his rhythm, and you see Joel now on the back foot in disadvantage, getting ledge trapped, and he, he just knows everything you're going to do. It's looking like an enchilada, bro. He's smothering Sauce right now. He's playing super aggressive. <laughs> you know, I am lucky I ate right before this block. <laughs> exactly. There you go. Because yeah, all these food references. <laughs> oh, see. my God. I'll see you beat up later. <laughs> Oh, down there, throw coming out. Now looking for a fireball again. And Sauce finding that up smash. He's getting comfortable again. He's resetting in neutral and getting Beast second guessing. Yeah, this is where he wants to be. Okay, and Beast playing a bit more patient. Now getting the F tilt string, but couldn't convert fully. I'm like the one two jab right there. Oh, looking to get back on the stage, catching that jump there with a the nair. Oh, but. Thought he was going to land on top of him again. Sauce fading back. And 58%. He's getting really tough. Oh. No jumps. Oh, he might be gone. Oh. Oh. Okay, nice. Wow. What an interaction. I'm actually pissed off. <laughs> You're pissed off? Oh, my! Is that down air spike? Yeah. This is Beast. He's, he's waking up. He's, he's got that Zard in him, bro. Yeah. He's not the dog. <laughs> he got the lizard on. He's got the whole lizard. <laughs> oh, okay, but he finds yeah. that smash. Okay. There you go. All right, but that's that's one game lost. So it's 2-1 in our side. 2-1 in Beast's favor. Sauce slowly but surely trying to bring this game back. But, dude, like, the way that Sauce is like, I, he's slowly starting to adapt again, like feeling comfortable staying towards the ground, realizing that Beast is a very aggressive player, and he's going to find a lot with that Squirtle and that Ivysaur. He's playing back a little bit and using much more of that Flood. Flood yeah. and Fireball. <laughs> so if I'm... I just read the shirt. 
But <laughs> 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 what is it? If you, you're a sauce, you're, you should be feeling yourself, especially with the confidence, because you, as you stated before, you took taking the last few sets, mm -hmm. and your beast, you're trying not to get into your own head, because it's like, okay, I lost the game, and it's this where it goes downhill. Say, so try to remember how you want games one and two, and be like, all right. This is my game plan, and try not to stray too far away from it, because the Sauce hasn't really adapted too much to what Beast has done. He's more of like how he's faltered, mm -hmm. like because Beast is starting to change it up and like his game plan up a bit more, and that's where Sauce has been getting his advantage. If he goes back to the old game plan, where like just run up with Squirtle, like F tilt like that, and just do a bunch of safe attacks, Sauce is gonna start faltering a, a bit more. Yeah, exactly. Like, I think Beast is kind of like struggling in the wrong areas right now. It's kind of like overthinking this, where Sauce is just kind of like, okay, well, the second that you give me a, that little sort of leeway, like backing up with Ivysaur, I have the tools to deal with yeah. this. I have the tools to get back up. And once you start playing patient, get back in and, and find these combos, like those down airs on shield, trying to find the ladder combo again. Just be just struggling to get back in with this Ivysaur. Oh, oh, oh the spot wait, just getting yeah. called out. And we saw that with the Jackal set. He does back air to spot dodge a lot. So definitely a player habit, been called out. A lot of people are starting to catch on. Ooh. For that cape there, Stossel able to make it back. Able to get a bit of percent on the flamethrower. Ooh, the spacing with that up smash on the shield. He had just not able to be punished the way Beast wants it to be. Like the air dodge down to avoid that. Saw still sitting, standing high with, oh, oh. the last hit of the down air. Yeah, maybe Beast is right. This is the only Zard I've seen that never gets, okay, able to get those back there, but never gets a good attack on from, like, Flame Door. Yeah, that's, that's fair. Yeah, he, fair evaluation he, he, like, after that last time. Like, he, he's, like, talked about it a lot with me. He's like, yeah, I, I never, Flame Door just doesn't work for me. <laughs> I see all the other Zards use it, and me, nothing. <laughs> I, I just kind of throw it out because I have. Yeah, to. yeah, he's like, if the move has a 95 hit percent ratio, I'm the 5%. <laughs> Yeah, see, he's just trying to hold the ledge here, trying to keep Sauce guessing on his toes. Yeah. Sauce now trying to find a downer, something to close the stock. At 193, you need literally anything to take the stock, yeah. and that is going to do it on yeah. that side. He was playing with house money there, and I'm not talking about HO3K. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Well, that, that was a good one, right? <laughs> yeah, was, yeah, was, okay. okay. Shout out, Devin. Devin, if you're watching, bro, yeah, I hope you like that one. But throwing out that flood again, there you go, keeping that squirtle out of your face. And yeah. just go, approaching when you want to. Getting him on that platform, getting him uncomfortable. That's what you want when you're playing Mario. Yeah. Approach when the time fits. Yeah, no, definitely. Oh! <laughs> Calling out that jump, saying you like to do it here, and killing him for it. Okay, switching to air dodge, but he's going to DI it correctly there. Sauce, unfortunately, at his final stock of this tournament, but Beast with a really aggressive fly. Final stock of this game four. If Saw is able to bring this back in this game, we could be seeing a game five for your player four. Yeah, and, and it's not something where you want to be. You're a fan of these. This will not look good. How will this affect his legacy? Oh, how will it affect LeBron's legacy? <laughs> <laughs> well, Bears coming out again. Sauce waiting patiently for that switch. Definitely third best. <laughs> oh, and yep. Yep. Still behind Kareem. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. His, his legacy is has not really shifted. Yeah, much. stuck at two.